What up in this John? It's your boy IBS Kelso, and today we're gonna be trying out Track Day R. Um, I have about a hundred minutes on the game, so it's not fully first impressions, but it is first impressions. Um, first hundred minutes was literally trying to fix my settings and trying to get powdered. Huge shout out to Powder for getting my my settings completely right. Uh, coming from MX Bikes to over here, the settings completely different. I don't feel like shifting with my Square and X button and just other stuff. So I wanted to make sure that I kind of had it towards what I'm used to. And I was finally able to get it dialed in. I don't know if I can switch the audio. The audio is going to be super loud. So if anything, I'm going to have to turn down the game audio completely. And I've tried it multiple times. It just keeps resetting. So if here's a bug or if that's a fix to that, let's try to work on that. All right, baby. We're here at the track. Let's just get some good riding time in. Um, there's a lot of good engine braking in this game. I would say the brakes, you ha I literally have them on max. And sometimes they work. Sometimes they don't, dude. I don't know. But this game literally kind of goes off of like IRL physics at times times um I'm not, I'm not saying it's like literally like the identical but um over jumping is really a bad time in here well, under jumping could really be like the deficit but i really enjoy that when you fall and stuff you have to get back on the bike um the whips feel a little weird uh just because i've never had the lean or i've never had the whip on my left analog stick coming from mx bikes so something's gonna be new and i'm literally casing everything but I think standing up is very, uh, very forgiving at times. But just knowing when to sit and stand in this game is going to be huge. And how much power you need to give these bikes. I don't know if you guys can understand. This is actually, oh my god, stick drift. Oh! Yeah, almost fell off the bike. Imagine stick drift actually coming into play right there. But, um, yeah, this is actually Argentina, or at least like a little replica of Argentina. This little scrub right there. They do have a uh, first person now, so I am gonna give that a go in this in this video, just to see how it feels. Can't turn the bike. What the heck? That's kind of weird. Like I'm literally trying to turn the bike, and the bike's like still going one way. Big boy jump. Nice. So the brake tapping feels great too. I don't know if you guys seen that, but I did brake tap right there. That felt pretty nice. If we can actually connect in this rut right here. Felt really fast. Felt like I. It felt like it didn't matter if I needed to connect or not. Like it wasn't gonna like upset the bike. But I guess that's something to where it's like connecting your ruts aren't aren't the biggest problem in this game. But I do have erode on or erosion to where like the track will break down as you ride on it. So I like that it will adjust and it, it will continue to, I guess, change up on you. I'm glad that they have that in the game. Nice. Doesn't it, The game feels fast at times and then the game doesn't feel fast at times as well. To where it's like, I think like I'm going like super speed, but then I'm at like 50 miles per hour, you know? And I think like the bike, the drivetrain and all that, and like how the bikes react right now, they're in a good setting. I think just air physics are a little weird. I think air physics and turning physics just aren't up to par at times, but the game does feel nice. The graphics look amazing. Um, and maybe, maybe I just don't have my settings or my lead settings and turning just correct or cor like fully dialed in. Because once again, I'm only at 100 minutes on this game. So maybe there's even more stuff that I could really load into. But huge shout out to Powder, man. The game does feel better than what I actually got the like started the game on. Fourth gear wicked. Double. Double. Now I don't know if it's just this this part of the track that's weird, but it is so hard to actually like oh my god, what a kicker. Oh I don't know what it is, but that part of the track is so hard to conquer, dude. Like the bike won't turn, and then like there's weird spots in that little spot. I'm it's definitely gonna be like the, the death of me in this video, I feel like. I've tried it even earlier, man. It's so weird. But I love that. In this game, you actually fall and you have to get it back up on the bike. That's actually really cool. It's actually really sick. But let's try to lock back in. See what? Oh no! Lock back in, fall again. <laughs> Yo, I'm not even mad though that I'm falling and having to get back up on the bike. It's a really cool feature, and it's actually something really cool for if you're like when multiplayer becomes like a big thing. If you fall, you have to literally lose all that time, so you gotta gain it back up. I wish it was something like MX Bikes would kind of look at and try to do it, but dude, MX Bikes barely just got an update a whole year later, so. Let's see here. 
good drive. Yeah, see, the scrubs or, like, the whips in the air just feel weird. I'm just not used to it. Lower down, yep. Nice. Sometimes you don't get traction. I mean, I guess the traction's there and not there, like, IRL-wise, where, like, if you're actually trying to make a full turn, you're fully pinned, it's not going to give you the best traction, so I kind of like that. That physic right there. I don't know why my bike is just leaning back like that. Like, I'm trying to pull it forward, and it's just not happening, so. Glad that I'm not having, like, really bad physics, though, to where it's, like, crashing me because of it. You know what I mean? It's just, it's landing me correctly. The rollers feel great. Felt like I was able to keep a good amount of power through all of that. Lower down. Nice. Game feels great. I'm gonna have to try that first person after this one. Oh, thought that was a bad over jump. I thought that was gonna be so bad. I I definitely wanna try that first person after this one. After this lap, scrub. Nice. Fourth gear. Letting that thing sing at high RPMs, dude. All right, and we conquer this little spot. I don't know why it's so hard. Well, there we go. You just gotta get, you gotta be a little bit more slower. Gotta be a little bit more technique. Fourth gear. Oh, slow down. Connect. There we go. Drive, drive, drive. I think it's the. I think it's like when you go off of a, like a little lip, the bike just likes to lean back for no reason. You gotta really like focus on keeping that lower that that front end down. Very, I'm very curious to see what the GP bikes feel like. Oh, yeah. Also, I want to go into first person. I forgot that they added this. Oh, the game feels fast as crap. Holy smokes. I'm at like a, I think I'm at like a 110 FOV as well. Let's see how this feels, though, for like a lap or so. The game does feel like fast. It feels different, too. Yeah, that just feels weird. I don't know, it feels weird, but it feels nice. It's not bad. I think you're just... Oh, oh, oh! You can go into your settings also. Oh, man, I fell. You can go into your settings also and change, like, how your FOV and everything, like, looks and feels like. I don't think, I don't think like, I have enough time on this game to do all that. But, um, we'll probably work for it later and probably find the best settings for it. But right now, first person in this game feels really fast. It feels, it feels weird. Like, third person's really, like, the main priority. But I hope that can change and and feel a little bit better to me as we continue to ride it. Like that's fast, dude. Holy smokes! Not bad. Let's see what I can do up this little freaking thing. Nice. Yeah, it feels like I'm going 10 miles, like a million miles a minute. It feels definitely more faster. Obviously, I mean, more than anything. Third person is not going to feel that fast just because you're in third person. But when you get into that first person aspect, the game does feel very, very high speed. Oh, second gear, second gear, slow down. Let's go up this little thing. How am I sliding out? No. Also, I don't think there's a, I don't think there's a way for you to like turn. Like if you ever stop completely, I don't know. I might have to look at that. I don't think there's a thing for if you like completely stop, you can actually push the bike, like a push push aspect. Oh, you can hear the brakes. Wow, you can actually hear the front brakes right there. Whoa, that's so crazy. You can actually hear the front brakes, dude. It's actually wild. <laughs> that's so crazy, dude. That's cool, man. I didn't know, and it sounds like a snake hissing. Nice. Yeah, I mean, I shouldn't say... Yeah, I'm going to go back to third person. I don't think first person's bad. It's just very fast. I got to get used to that. But so far, overall, the game is, is phenomenal to me. Oh, my... Dude, I literally just endoed so hard. I thought I was going to save that, man. My guy literally... So, endoing, yeah, that's too much pressure on your front. You're falling. Let's see how I feel getting up this hill. Ugh. Pick up the bike it. Oh, so that's the only time you can push a bike, maybe. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? What the heck, dude? Come on.
on, baby. Pick the bike up. Come on. Gonna skip half this side of the track. Yeah, you might. Honestly, I, I'm probably gonna make another video on this. On this, like this is my first impressions of the game, and it feels nice. It feels great. I will have to make another video. Um, maybe try to maybe try to challenge myself to something. See how I really feel, and like if I can run some really good times. Maybe do like like five, three laps without falling or something like that. Nice. It's awesome, man. Thank you guys for watching. I greatly appreciate it. I'm just gonna continue crashing. Hopefully you guys pick up this game, try it out. I know the Steam summer sale is going on, so I think it's like 25 bucks right now on Steam. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate y'all. Um, this game is not bad. Not bad at all for what for the early stages that as, that it is in. So um, yeah, hit that like button, subscribe button. I appreciate y'all and yeah, thank you guys for watching, man. Unreal this. Scrub. Nice. Still gotta work on this spot, dude. This spot's really weird and the turning physics are not it. But alright, too easy. Catch you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Pop up, pop up, pop up, pop up. Bye.